It's Thanksgiving, so we decided to have some fun too. We're both fantasy football guys, so we oh, decided yeah. to have a Thanksgiving food fantasy football draft. Not football, but fantasy draft, Pete. Right. I was being, uh, I mean, I was being a very good friend. I gave you the number one overall pick. Yes. Uh, Who'd you take? I am going to have to start with uh, my first pick is going to be stuffing. Uh, some good homemade stuffing. There's nothing like it, and my reason for this is because this is a true Thanksgiving dish. When else during the year do you have stuffing? I agree. Yeah. I agree. Never. Just on Thanksgiving. Yeah, exactly. All right. It's You're a Thanksgiving right. dish through and through. Not very popular with Maine athletics, typically football, but we'll go aside. I am a big mm. dessert guy. When it comes to Thanksgiving, you will catch me at the table on dessert, mm. and I'm a pie guy. Give me any flavor of pie, pumpkin, apple. My grandma makes a chocolate cream pie. That sounds Absolutely fantastic. unreal. Uh, blueberry. You name it, I will eat any kind of pie. Mm. Any okay. pie. All right, so we got the sweets off the board, or the pie at least. So uh, <laughs> I'm going back to savory. I'm gonna okay. I'm gonna take a pick that's gonna pair really well with my uh, with my first pick. It's gonna be gravy. Uh, I think this is the best pick of the draft. You know, <laughs> I, this is like drafting the wide receiver for your stud quarterback that you just drafted in the first round. Yeah. You need to pair it because together uh, it's it's gonna be a party, a party in your mouth, a party on the <laughs> field. You know, we're we're making these comparisons. We're we're really. <laughs> We're really pushing it right now. Like the rug on the Big Lebowski, I feel like gravy just ties the room together. It really does. You know? It can go on basically anything <laughs> on your plate, too. And your gravy pick got me thinking there's no Thanksgiving without the turkey. Mm. I'm usually not the biggest turkey fan. I yeah. went to my uncle's wedding this past summer and at the, some hotel in Kennebunkport. Mm -hmm. Best turkey I've ever had. So if you can make really? a turkey like that every time, I will eat it every time. I mean, it's... It's hard to get it that good, but yeah. it was unreal, and you can't have a Thanksgiving without a nice, juicy bird. Yeah, I was, you know, I'm surprised to see turkey lasting this long. It's, it's de <laughs> definitely a staple uh, of your of your Thanksgiving team, I would say, your meal team, uh, and that's a good choice right there. And yeah, I coming think, off the board late this year. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> All right, well, we're, uh, we're going back uh, here, and I'm going to have to go with canned cranberry sauce, not that homemade junk. Got to have the canned. Uh, <laughs> I want that jelly, like fake looking stuff, because for some reason, it's just, it offers that tartness and that. It's got to have the ridges on the side, yeah, so you know where to cut. The canned ridges, <laughs> yeah, those are fantastic. And right there, those are like the bases of my Thanksgiving sandwich you know, sl throw uh, a slab of turkey in there right there but one two three stuffing gravy cranberry sauce and maybe some turkey and you got a you got a perfect Thanksgiving yeah, it's sandwich almost right time there. for turkey sandwiches right yeah all right <laughs> and you my, got one more my pick, pick here. my last pick and I'm surprised these guys went last mm. mashed potatoes the last pick in our little three pick draft you got the butter you have the uh, you got it's creamy they're yeah. fluffy they just kind of melt in your mouth especially yeah. when they're hot I think you can't have a Thanksgiving plate a true Thanksgiving plate mm -hmm. without a heaping pile of mashed potatoes and then when you go back for seconds you know like sometimes I'll leave stuff off first round and go back right. and get them in the second mashed potatoes I'll get both times up that's great I think we both had some some strong drafts here uh, I would like I'd be interested in seeing how they would uh, go up against one another yeah <laughs> mid-season form <laughs> yeah exactly